Hi there, so in this video we will see how to install Node.js and NPM package management system on Windows operating system, okay? So go to nodejs.org and it will show you page similar to this. It will also detect your version of operating system and it will present you option to download long-term release of Node.js or stable release, out of which you can select the one depending on your choice. Click on stable if you want to get the latest version. Clicking on it will start the download in the background. In meantime, you can go to downloads page and check the available binaries. You can install from .msi.exe and also choose the 32-bit or 64-bit installer. Okay, and if you have any other operating system, you can also select. And there is also option for source code which you can use to install from source now open the file this should start the node.js installer okay now Run the installer. Click on next. Accept the license agreement. Go through it if you want to read all. And then click next. Select the directory in which you want to install Node.js. I will keep it default. Okay then make sure that everything for node.js runtime and pm package manager documentation and add to path are selected then click on next and then hit install okay it will take some time to process and after installation it will bring up next button okay in between open text editor and create a file name sample.js here type in console.log and then put a message node.js installed and then save this file and minimize the text editor okay so node.js is being installed let me open command prompt it in the background and so it will take some time to copy the files get new components let it add node.js into the path so that's why I closed a command prompt okay now that it is finished installation I'm going to open command prompt and go to the D drive and then type let's say node then space then dash V and it will return you the version of 
node.js that is installed on your system. Now I'm going to type in npm dash p. It should show you npm version that is installed. Okay, so 3.3.12 is installed. Now I'm going to execute one sample program that we just created earlier. Okay, so it return node.js install. If all three of these tests pass, that means node.js is successfully installed on your system. Now you can use node.js, you can use npm package manager, and you can run your JavaScript code with the help of node command. So this is a short video on how to install node.js and npm package management system on your Windows platform.